everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hello, welcome. My name is Jessica. I am a fashion, lifestyle, and travel blogger. And I love creating content that helps you live your most chic and fabulous life, but on a budget. So if you are interested in that, then I would definitely recommend you hitting that red subscribe button right down below and um, maybe possibly doing the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of my uploads. Typically they go up Mondays and Thursdays every once in a while on a Saturday. Today I am doing yet another Amazon haul, but this time the theme is going to be athleisure, workout gear, all that kind of good stuff. So we're really focusing on stuff that is very comfortable, perfect for wearing to the gym, or just wearing, running errands, wearing around the house, being comfortable, all that jazz. So definitely just to get yourself a glass of water, a cup of tea, a cup of coffee, settle in, because I have some awesome pieces to show you in today's haul. Now, as always, everything I'm sharing is going to be linked down in the description box. You can shop everything very easily. I will also have my sizing information and the sizes that I got right down there for you. So you can kind of use that to gauge what size you might need to get. Without further ado, let's jump right in. First set of items to talk about, I wanna start with these yoga pants. So I had never heard of this brand before I purchased this pair and typically in most brands for yoga pants, I take a size small. So I did that with this one, but when I put them on, when I tell you, like, have you ever put on yoga pants where like you pulling it over your foot and you can already tell it's gonna be really tight? That's what happened here. Like I was pulling it over my heels and I was like, this has literally no stretch or give and this is gonna be so tight. And while they technically are on my body, I would, I'm not keeping them. They run way too like tight and small. I would need a medium and it's, it's gonna be a no. They just, they're so tight. It's very disappointing because the print is really cute, right? I love the tropical vibe going on. I love that they have pockets on both sides. Yoga pants with pockets just makes my life because when I'm going for a walk, I love to be able to put my my phone in my pocket there but yeah if, you, if you're thinking about trying these i would say maybe size up if you're like me i feel like my bottom half is where a lot more of my weight goes so i have a lot more of a, a booty and hips and thighs so if you're like that too i would say definitely think about sizing up in this brand just because it's gonna be very tight. Moving on to the sports bra, I have a couple sports bras in this haul, but for the most part, it's gonna be a lot of bottoms in this. I'm just gonna be straight up. There's a lot of pants in this haul, but I wanted to try some sports bras because I do have a larger chest and I do a lot of really high intensity workouts that involve jumping, running, and I have been searching my entire life for sports bras that actually work. I, I usually have to wear like two at a time to get the kind of support that I'm looking for, but I looked around for some high impact sports bras with good reviews and this was one of them and it's very affordable so I thought I would give it a try and I have to say it passes the jump test. I don't feel like I would need to wear another sports bra. Like everything's very supported. It's not moving, which is all the things that I'm looking for in a sports bra and I love the design of it. I think it looks really cool. It's got this sort of like, I mean, it kind of honestly does look like I'm wearing two sports bras, right? but it's all one. Maybe that's what makes it so good. It is two sports bras built into one, but it feels great on, and I love the design. I think it's a really cute design. It comes in some other colors, uh, if you don't want just like plain white, uh, but this is a great sports bra, and I highly recommend for anybody who is doing high impact workouts that involve jumping, you're definitely gonna love this because literally it just keeps everything in place, so this second piece is definitely a success in my book. This next piece are these leggings, also from the same brand as before. I believe the brand is called Adodos. I hope I am saying that right. It sounds funny, but that's what the tag appears to say. This is also in a size small, like the previous pair, but something about these feels a little bit less constricting than the other pair. It could also be that it's extremely hot today, and so just any putting on anything that's like tight-fitting is kind of a miserable exercise. That is very possible, but these I just feel like are a bit more stretchy. They feel like they breathe a little bit more, and I love the style of these. It's so flattering. First of all, I love the little like aspect of the fact that they're high-waisted, but they kind of cross over in the front. They come down to like a little bit of a dip in your waist. Something about that is so flattering. They're, it's kind of ruched on the sides. It's just, it's very unique. It's a style that I don't see very often. In yoga pants, I feel like a lot of times they're just like straight across. This just makes you look so hourglassy. I also love that it also has nice pockets on both sides like the previous pair did. And they just are made very flattering. They have a good amount of compression to them. I feel like everything is sort of like 
that could also be due to the fact that they feel a little bit tight but now that I have them on I am comfortable so I think smalls are appropriate in this situation sometimes there's just yoga pants when you get them for the first time they're gonna be a little bit tight but now that these are on they feel good whereas the last pair even while I had them on for a couple minutes I still felt uncomfortable so maybe their sizing just runs a little bit different between styles so in this style I would say maybe just take your normal size that you would get um, but I love these they look so good on they're very very comfortable and I feel like they, I could just live in these whether in the gym or at home um, going out running errands they're a great pair of yoga pants highly recommend I apologize in advance for how white my legs are right now on to a pair of shorts these are like a running short I don't have a whole lot of pairs of these but I figured they would be great for hiking and such things or just running errands so I picked up this pair this is so cute I love first of all the like light sagey color of them they've got these great pockets on either side that unzip so you could store your keys your phone your card or whatever you want to take with you and then secure it nice and tight right up in there so if you're jogging or hiking or whatever you know whatever you have in your pocket is not going to accidentally fall out so they're nice little running shorts they're in this very um, moisture wicking material in fact let me just tell you it is uh, 95 percent polyester and five percent spandex the inside i'll just show you has like this little built-in like bikini bottom thing situation so that let's say were you to like lift your leg for any purpose you kind of have this like sort of built-in brief there to sort of keep anything from being shown which is nice they're really comfortable the waist has a lot of stretch in it and it also has a drawstring there so you can adjust it tighter if need be but a great little pair of running shorts perfect like obviously for the gym or going on a jog but i feel like also cute enough that you could wear you know in everyday life and especially when it's hot they're nice and lightweight and moisture wicking so that you can be comfortable in this extreme heat that we are all in right now next pair of bike shorts are sort of my first foray into like the super short bike shorts. I have a lot of like weird hangups about my upper thighs. I don't really like to wear tight short shorts like these because I feel like they make me feel like things are coming out of the shorts in ways that I don't like but I actually really think that these biker shorts work really well and they don't actually do that I really wanted to get a pair of shorter biker shorts just to have to wear under like certain skirts or dresses because sometimes when you wear like a shorter skirt or dress you just feel a little bit like insecure if the wind is gonna blow up or something with these they're nice and short so they can go under any of those and I can feel secure in that if any wind does arise and flip my skirt up that people aren't going to be seeing everything if you know what I mean so these are really great for that and I actually think I will wear these to the gym I felt like when I first saw them that they were gonna be too short but I feel really good about them and the fabric on them feels so good I actually ordered these in a medium with the full knowledge that I don't like things to be too tight so if you're like me and you want it to have a little bit less of a constricting fit especially if you are bigger on your bottom half I would recommend sizing up one because that will just make it just a little bit more room to breathe there and it won't make it look like you know just, just stuff busting out of the shorts so that is like my little tip with little short shorts is to just size up one because I feel like it just gives you just a tiny bit more fabric and breathing room for it to be more flattering but they're very comfortable they feel very soft and I love these I think I will wear them by themselves and not just as a thing underneath a skirt or a dress which was my initial intention so it might appear that I did not change my outfit, but I did. I have on a whole new set of things. So let's start with the sports bra. This one is from Champion. It looks very similar to the one that I had on before, but you might notice it has a zipper up at the front. It also has like a hook and eye closure inside of this. Um, and it is like a full on situation in the back. You can see that it has some adjustable straps back there. So this is also another high impact sports bra. And I can also say it really does pass the jump test. I feel very secure in this. I don't feel like I need to wear a second sports bra underneath it, which is so great. I love finding good sports bras. It is just like finding gold or something for me. Um, and it just, it feels very secure. They do these on your actual bra size, which is great because sometimes when the sports bras go like small, medium, large, it's not a great effective sizing system. So I got this in a 34 double D, which is my typical bra size. And I feel like it fits great. Everything is in and it just is very, very supportive and awesome. So another really great affordable high impact sports bra option on Amazon if you're looking for one. Now moving on to these biker shorts that I have on. These are from Amazon The Drop, which is a fashion 
line that Amazon has. So they're not necessarily like for working out. I would not wear these to the gym. And I don't know if it's coming off on camera, but they have a sort of like faux leather look to them. And they are very comfortable. I got these in a small that is like definitely the size that I always get in the drop and they fit very true to size. They're really comfortable. They have a lot of stretch and I like that faux leather look. It's kind of cool. I definitely have been wearing these a lot with like an oversized t-shirt over the top of them. That's definitely what I think these are good for because I just don't think these are really meant for the gym. They're just not like a performance garment, you know, they're more fashion clearly because they're trying to look like faux leather. So definitely a cute bike short if you want one just for the express purpose of wearing for just like running around wearing underneath like oversized t-shirts and whatnot. This is definitely a great pair because it has that cool sort of texture to it with that faux leather look. The next pair of shorts is really similar to the previous running shorts that I picked up from the same brand, but different in a couple key ways. First of all, the fabric is definitely different. They are a little bit more of a soft fabric and it like almost more of like a yoga pant fabric, but looser and in a running short. Like the little double layer thing that it has going on there. I mean, they're not double layered, but it definitely just looks like that. It's just a design element that I think is really, really cute. And they're so comfortable. They have a lot of stretch in the waistband. They also have this nice little back pocket right back here. So you can put your keys or your phone, whatever you need to keep on you while you're jogging or running around because they don't really have little side pockets due to the fact that they're just a shorter style. Um, but they're very cute, very flattering. Again, just like the other shorts, I think they are great for wearing to the gym. They're definitely great for jogging outside in this heat, but I think that they're definitely cute enough to wear just in an outfit while you're running around, running errands. They're super comfortable. Again, super moisture wicking. They also have little built-in bikini brief built in that's uh, this very breathable fabric so that again if for whatever reason you have to like lift up your leg kick your leg or whatever um, you're not going to be showing people anything um, underneath your shorts so a great pair of running shorts they come in a bunch of different colors I just love this dark olive color because I feel like it's a great neutral that goes with a bunch of different stuff this next item I am obsessed with it's a little tennis skirt and again so comfortable I got this in a size medium just because I figured because it has these little built-in shorts underneath that I would want that extra room and not feel like everything was being squeezed super tight in that area of my leg and I do think that was a good decision although I do feel like I also have a little bit of extra room in the waist that I don't need but it's not the end of the world like it doesn't feel like anything's falling down I don't feel like it looks slouchy or ill-fitting it's just something that I noticed so again Look at the size charts for each of these things and choose your size based on that. I did that and I think it really worked out for me in the end, but these are so cute. Whether or not you play tennis, which I don't play tennis really a lot, like I'll go every once in a while and try to play. I'm not good at all, but this is just so cute. It could also be really cute if you golf or regardless, you could wear this just to work out in the gym and be really cute because again, it's a skirt, but it has built in shorts underneath and the shorts are this really nice, very breathable fabric they're very stretchy it's really comfortable and I also really love because they're made for tennis on one side you have a pocket where the the entryway of the pocket is on the bottom so you can stick tennis balls in there so they're easy access while you're playing and the other side the pocket is on the top again you could use that for tennis balls you could also use this for your phone keys whatever because you know it's going up this way so everything you put in there will be secure but on top of that for storage, you also have another one of these little back pockets like those previous shorts had. So it's really great. I got this really bright pink color, comes in a ton of other colors, some more like neutral tones if you're not into being like super crazy bright, but I think I'm gonna need some more styles of this just because it's adorable. It's really flattering on. It's got a really cute little like, it's sort of a flat skirt in the front but the back is just slightly pleated for more movement and stuff back there. So a really cute piece. And um, again, I'm, I'm probably gonna get more colors of this just because I'm obsessed. And like the other pieces, you could totally wear it to play tennis, golf, or work out, but it's also just a really cute piece that you could wear in everyday life. And it's sporty, it's comfortable, and I feel like it is pretty stylish as well. So. This next pair of pants is so much fun. It's sort of like a cross between a sweat pant and a yoga pant, if that makes any sense. They feel so good on, seriously, like feels like the best pair of yoga pants, but because they're made to be a little bit more baggy so that they fit like a jogger or a sweat, Oh, I love it. And it's just like something like a jogger or a sweat pant that I feel like I can wear when it's hotter out because to me, there's nothing worse than wearing a fleece sweatpant when it's hot. This is like a more moisture wicking material so it just feels so comfortable. These would be so cute with like a white tank top and a jean jacket with some sneakers as like an airport traveling outfit. 
don't you think? I, I feel like they would be. Um, I love this like shiny leopard print situation. This pant comes in some like just solid colors, but when I saw the shiny leopard print version, I just needed to have it because I thought it was just really, really cool and edgy. And I feel like this pant could be a just a cool option that you could wear. You could really edge it up with some cool sneakers, a cool jacket or a cool tee, and it could go from being something that you wear just around the house or at the gym to being maybe a really cool street style outfit. So this is one piece that I think could cross over from being athletic wear into being that more cool street style vibe. Um, but again, so comfortable. I got a medium and I feel like they do fit pretty slim. So if you want like that true baggy look, and you are bigger on your bottom half like I am, I might recommend going up maybe even two sizes to get that true baggy look. But if you take your normal size, then probably, I mean, it, it still looks cute. Honestly, I think they look cute. They do have a little bit of breathing room. They're not skin tight. But again, if you want that true like jogger, more baggy look, definitely think about sizing up two sizes because um, you know that it has like a little drawstring situation right here in the waist. So even if it is big everywhere else, you can cinch it in here and it will fit great. The other thing that I think is really interesting is it has pockets, but in the right pocket, it has like a pocket within a pocket. And I'm like, what's that about? I mean, maybe you could put your keys or your, your card or your ID in there to keep it even more secure to make sure it doesn't fall out. But I've never seen a pocket like that before. It's, it's very, very interesting. I love these. I've been wearing these all weekend and I just, I could live in them. They're, they're incredibly comfortable. Last item in this haul is this dress. I've been thinking about getting one of these dresses for a while. I don't know. They're like a athletic wear dress, athleisure dress, I don't know. Um, I would say this is definitely not great for like heavy duty workouts, but it would be really fun for tennis or golf or just chilling in, running errands. It's so comfortable. It's literally a dress with a built-in biker shorts underneath and little pockets. So it's perfect for just running around and looking cute. You could pair this with some sneakers or some sandals and it's just a great thing to have just in your wardrobe when you need to run a bunch of errands. It's a hot day. You just wanna be comfortable, but it also just looks really, really cute. I really liked this sort of like blue color, but it comes in a bunch of different colors, obviously. It has a lot of stretch to it. Um, I'm not entirely sure what size I'm wearing. I think it's a small, but of course, like I said, all the sizes that I ordered will be down in the description box with the links to each item. Um, but I would say it just take your true size. I love that the straps in the back are adjustable so you can adjust it a little bit more. It has a shelf bra that's sort of built into it. Not the most supportive ever. So if I was to play tennis in this, I would probably put a sports bra on underneath it. For golf, I would probably just wear it as is because I don't feel like I need to wear super supportive um, undergarments for that sport. Um, but yeah, I, I love it. This has definitely been a piece that I've seen a lot on TikTok and I've been on the fence about buying it, but I'm so glad I finally did. I also think it's really flattering. Like the dress part of it it fits it goes in at the waist a bit but the whole dress aspect of it just sort of skims your body and goes away from it so it's really cute it's comfortable and I this is another piece that I've been living in since I got it because I just I think it's so cute I love the little shorts underneath I feel like I could just do anything in this dress go anywhere you can't tell me nothing I can get all my errands done and look adorable and sporty while doing it okay so. thank you so much for watching this video I am if you made it this far you are amazing. Thank you so much. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you found anything in this video that you loved. I am always looking for really great new clothes to wear to the gym because it just makes me feel so much more motivated when I feel like I'm cute in something fresh. And so just refreshing my workout wardrobe every once in a while really helps me out. So leave a comment down below and let me know if you feel the same way. I would love to chat with you guys down there. Before you go, you might want to check out a couple more videos which I have picked out for you right here. And if you're not already subscribed, hit that red subscribe button, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.